So I already have the syringe full of Brazi semen, that Brazi blood. It's my girl Kiki right here. What I usually do before I do it, I go ahead and I just kind of rub on, I guess you want to call it the gooch between the butt and the vagina. So I rub on that just to kind of get her to uh, contrast, kind of pull that in. Take it. You want to stick it in. I've already lubed the tip. You lube it with some um, non-spermicidal uh, lubricant. And then you want to take it and take it at the top. So it should go like that. Not like that, but at the top. So when I do mine, when I put mine in, I usually put a finger in with it. And then that, that way it guides this top. That way it just guides the top right there on in there and where I need it to go. So just glide the top of the vagina. You don't want to force, you don't want to push it. It should just glide straight on down, especially if you have the uh, grease on there. So you just slid on down. And I push it in slow, I don't push them in fast. And after I do that, to make sure everything is out of the tube, I just pull it out just a little bit, grab the yellow part, the tip of it, take it off. And you wanna squeeze the top so don't none of the semen come out. And then we raise this back out just to push a little air in there to clear the whole straw out. See, now I've cleared the straw out. And here's the syringe. You want to get the right size that is for your dog. Some um, people use the big long one for their small dogs. If you look at it when ordering these off of Amazon, you can see it says for large, small, or medium sized dog. So get the one that is for your dog. Kind of play around it, just kind of touch and tickle around it. That way she contrasts. Some people keep their finger in there. I don't see a reason to keep the finger in there. I mean, when they do breeding natural, the um male, um, the male genitalia is always in the female, it stays in the female. So some people will, you know, keep a finger in there, you know, for the little 30 minutes or 20 minutes, however long they do. Um some people do 30 minutes. I like to do like 15 to 20 minutes. You know, that just gets the semen down to where it needs to go to. So I just hold her upside down like this. That way the semen can creep down and go where it needs to. Kind of tickle the back of her vagina or whatever, just so she can contrast. She can get that, keep doing that on the inside. That's just pulling the semen down to where it needs to go. Some, some dogs don't like to be upside down like this, so that's why I try not to leave my dog, you know, at this angle for too long. It's okay, mama. It's okay, good girl. Good girl. So you can give them a pillow or something so they can get comfortable. I have a dog who just lays on the ground, you know. It's okay, mama. Good girl. Good girl. Just let her know she's doing a good job. That's all you gotta do, let her know she's doing a good job. Occasionally make her contrast that vagina. Most dogs don't like to be in this position right here, so you just make them feel comfortable for the uh, 15, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, however long you keep them there. I try to do like 15 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes. Put on a movie, man, and just wait the time out. You know, put on a movie and wait the time out. 
The aftermath is definitely, definitely worth it, y'all. The aftermath is definitely worth it. This is how I do AIs here at a Flash Bully Kennel. I do my own AIs. I don't go anywhere to get my AIs done unless I'm just being lazy. Then I'll take them somewhere, the vet, or I'll call call one of my reproduction reproductive uh reproductive guys over or something. And, have them do it. That's only if I'm being lazy. Any other time, I'll just save the money and do it myself. Because for real, nobody cares for your dogs like you. No one's going to care for your dogs like you. It's your program. Good girl. Good girl. It's about time for some puppies here at Flash Bully Kennel, man. It's been a while. Been Make sure I like and subscribe. Hit that bell so you don't miss a thing. You don't want to miss this breeding. This is the second second time we ran this AI. And this is the second breeding here at Flash Bully Kennel. Make sure y'all hit that bell so y'all don't miss a thing every time I drop. Appreciate y'all tuning in. Make sure you like and subscribe. And share, man. Share for me. Uh-oh, somebody at the door.